gives me immense pleasure to welcome one and all for the inauguration of the bi-monthly Indian Economic Lecture Series and lecture on Indian economy and overview and how different it is. Well, friends, uh, as we all know, we have the most dynamic Prime Minister ever our country has had in uh, Mr. Narendra Modi. And we've seen a lot of measures, economic measures, being taken by the government in a very short span of time. And we expect India to be the real development story for the next five years. Well, as Hindustan Chamber has always been in the forefront of organizing such uh, thought-worthy lectures and thought-worthy commerce uh, uh, things which are concerning trade and commerce and industry, we thought it very fit to organize this year uh, while Dr. Dave took over as the president to have such series on the Indian economy and understand the inner strengths of our economy and what it can be the output that the economy can give us. Well, friends, I would first of all call upon our uh, president, Dr. Inar Dave, to lead the chief guest and lecturer of today's evening, Mr. S. Gurumurthy, eminent columnist, analyst, and renowned chartered accountant to the main dais, please. May I call upon each one of you all to give a round of applause. May I also request Mr. Murli, Mr. Nagapan to occupy the main dais. Thank you, gentlemen. I now call upon our president, Dr. Inar Dave, to give his welcome address. I think we'll start off with the prayer. So uh, let's have the prayer, please, while we remain standing. to welcome the gathering. Our respected and revered chief guest who is going to inaugurate our bi-monthly economic affairs lecture series Sri S. Guru Murthy The President-elect Sri V. Murli, the Chairman of Economy Affairs Sri Nagapan, all the eminent past presidents of Hindustan Chamber of Commerce, my dear colleagues in the Council as well as members of Hindustan Chamber of Commerce, invitees from other chambers, organizations, and institutions, and ladies and gentlemen. I'm really 
thrilled to have today's inauguration of this bi-monthly economic affairs lecture meeting. And uh, who else other than Sri S. Gurumurthy could inaugurate this eminent lecture series? He's a friend, philosopher, guide, as far as I am concerned. We have been working together for common cause, for upliftment of society, and also inculcating the value education and some scars amongst young generation. Let me tell you, during my public life of nearly 49, 50 years, I have come across various uh, eminent personalities from all walks of life. But then, when I came across Sri Yes Guru Murthy, I found him, him, found him in him a real spark. A real spark that our country should wake up to its realities. We should maintain our tradition samskaras and India should become one of the most advanced country in the field of economy, industry, commerce throughout the world. I have been very much impressed with this analysis, with his no deep sense of knowledge and the research work that he has carried out in the various fields. Today we are having our Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi and he has started this Make in India movement and he has given also a new terminology for FDI. First develop India, FDI, first develop India. And he has also said Chane Saat Saat, let's all walk together. It's a beautiful slogan, no doubt about it. I think after a long time we have got a Prime Minister who sincerely and really wants to work for the progress of our country. And uh, I'm very happy that he has achieved also many targets. He has planned so many innovations and I'm sure within another year or two we will be on the path of progress. As far as Hindustan Chamber of Commerce is concerned, which is 69 years old, it has been presided over and given the leadership by various eminent personalities of Chennai and they have been experts in trade, commerce and industries. So with their guidance and blessings, in the beginning of the year, when on, when on 29th September, when Srimati Nirmala Sitaraman ji came, at that time I had declared that we would like to inaugurate this bi-monthly series and it will be done by Sri S. Guru Murthy. And sir, at that time, the minister said, oh, it's a wonderful thing to have the churning, churning of a subject like economic affairs that is called manthan, vichara manthan. And she told me that after each lecture series, please send me the substance, sum and substance of the lecture series. So that is the interest that she has shown and this will be conducted six totally throughout the year. We are also going to have the Awareness Entrepreneurship Program for college students and that is going to be on 17th December along with MOP Vaishnav College. There are going to be after that we will choose students and make them interact with four clusters of 
industrialists, MSME industrialists in various places in Tamil Nadu. And after their interaction, we'll ask them to prepare a report and submit to the chamber and to the government of Tamil Nadu and government of India. We will have totally 11 major seminars and we are going to institute and present again on 23rd January when we are going to celebrate our Chamber's Day two Champion of Humanity Awards and that will be really another landmark function in the history of our Chamber. There are going to be six first generation successful entrepreneurs.